Hey everyone, this is Doc Williams with Brand Factory Inc. And um, we're starting a new program called Ask Doc. And basically I'm going to be answering tech questions, how to automate and grow your brand. So uh, we're starting this out. This is an experiment. We're going to see how it goes. But um, I get a lot of questions and uh, we're seeing if this is a good format. So I was talking to Andrew Warner over the weekend when we are at the conversation conference. And, uh, you know, so we're trying it out. So the first question was from Andrew was, uh, I use Zoom to record interviews. Got a way to share that to other platforms and to keep the chat in, in a single place. So uh, we're going to be answering that today and showing the, you the exact steps. Now, he actually paid for this. And so we encourage you, if you want us to do this for you, um, just hit us up. But we want to do this for you absolutely free. Andrew paid for this for you to get this knowledge so you can do it for your own business. But if you need help for us to do this for you, uh, hit us up at doc, D-O-C, at brandfactoryinc.com. So let's get into it and let's give you the answer to start automating and scaling your business. So what you're going to need for this, you're first going to need a Zoom account. You're going to need Restream and access to your uh, YouTube channel or Facebook group. But I would prefer you to just use your YouTube channel. So um, for your Zoom account, make sure that you have a Zoom account, a Zoom account and you're paying for Pro. So they allow you to get those features uh, that we need to connect this. So it's $14.99 and you can get a Restream account. Let's see what we need for this one. I think there's a free plan. Yeah, forever free. Excuse me. And um, also... You know, it depends on which one you're looking for, depending on how many destinations you need and all that kind of stuff, either the standard or the pro. But let's get right into it, how we're going to be doing this, right? Oh, and then, of course, your YouTube channel. You're going to just take your YouTube channel and then you're going to do slash live at the end. And we'll look at why that's important later. OK, let's get right into it. Um, so first, let's sign in into Zoom. You go into Zoom. Um, and I just, oop, hold on a second. I'm going to sign in. I have too many accounts, so I'm going to sign in. Okay. It's going to ask me. I have way too many accounts. Don't judge me. Okay. Sign in. That better be it. Okay, cool. So we have this right here and, uh, I'm going to sign into my restream account too. Oh my goodness, so I'm in here, oh my goodness, there's a hot mess everywhere. <sighs> Hold on. All right, let's do this thing. So, I had to sign in because I have way too many accounts. All right, so we just signed in to our Zoom account. Um, I'm going to use the instructions. I'm just going right there into the account settings. Okay, account settings. I go right there. After the account settings, basically you can change out your meeting types. You go under in meeting advanced and where you see a section where it's actually going to ask you for um, allow live streaming to the meetings, you're going to toggle confirm. The reason I can't show you in live, I've already toggled it and I've can't untoggle it right now. So once you toggle that, that allows you to then um, add a custom um, streaming URL. Okay, so what you're going to do is it's saying you can put in the directions so you can copy and paste. You can do that um, just so you have it on file. Um, so once you log into Restream, this is your RT. Uh, MP URL and then this is your stream key you can copy it and put it into this section right here now if you don't want to do that don't worry that's fine I'll show you in a second what you can do in your account okay after you do that you um, you uh, can save it and then you go on to the next section and you actually schedule a meeting okay so that's going to be in your advanced section. It's going to be there for you. Don't worry. I promise you it's going to be there for you. 
It's going to be in this section talking about live. Say yes. Then after you go to your um, your account again, you're going to go to meetings. Once you go to meetings, you're going to say schedule a meeting. Let's just say, I'll just say beta test for live streaming. Yeah, I'm going to do that. I'm going to have it right now. I'm going to save it. Now, once I save it, this will appear right here, the live streaming portion. And it allows you to configure what you need to do. Now, right here, you're going to configure your live stream. Now, how are you going to do that? Well, you're going to take your, um, your RTMP URL and your stream code and you're actually going to put it in. So, so you can't see my stream code. I'm going to pause it, put all this stuff in, and I'm going to add my YouTube account at the last section down below here, and then we'll get right into it. So hold on one second. Okay, so I save it right here, and now it has, yes, 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 calm down, guys, calm down. Right here, we have the stream URL, the stream key, all of that stuff in that starting place. Now, when I'm ready to go into the meeting, because now I have this set up to go to my areas. Oh, I should say this too. We'll go into this in a second, adding your channels. But once you have Zoom all set up, you're, you're, you're good to go. Okay, so you can actually start this meeting and then we'll go live in a few moments. Okay, now, before you go live, you have to plan on your destinations when it goes live, right? So what you're gonna be doing is you add a channel in the multi-streaming section. Right now, I have Mixer, Twitch, and uh, YouTube all streaming when this is all hooked up. What you do is basically, it's very intuitive. You add a channel and make sure that you log in and then it's gonna allow you, when you're ready, to connect. So for me, I have Mixer, Twitch, and then YouTube, all of this is hooked up and it's gonna stream because it has this key. So when I'm ready, I go over here, I say start meeting. It's gonna ask me, it's gonna ask me open, I'm gonna open that sucker. Once I'm about to start, I am here, this is good. I go to more, where it says right here live, I can go live on Facebook, uh, live on YouTube, but I want to go um, to a bunch of different areas at once, right? So I can go live on Custom Live, and I can do three at a time or more than that. It's going to then sync. Again, if you just wanted to go to YouTube or somewhere else, you, you don't even need all of these, but this is if you're trying to stream to you know three to 10 different um, providers at once. Okay, so it's going to come up, you're going to see it all links right here. It's going to live, remember, because I put that URL that this is my main live page. Okay, so have that. How do I know that it's working? It's saying it's going live right there. This is excellent. I'm going to share my screen um, with this live. I'm sharing my screen. That's great. Uh, that's wonderful um, and then I can go here and I can see what's happening and it's already syncing it's sending data to YouTube that usually takes a little bit longer to anyway um, so just keeping that in mind all of this stuff is working well and now you have just successfully streamed to all of your other platforms that you're looking for and um, and you're ready to go again this is how you're going to be streaming to multiple platforms at once. If you're just trying to stream to YouTube and then save it, do all that kind of stuff, you can just do that by one click in Zoom. This is for multi-platforms at once. So if you have any questions, let me know. We're going to be having uh, the breakdown of this video and the exact um, tutorials and what you need to be doing after this goes uh, live into the group. And again, if you need help with this, if you need help in your business for us to do it, just let us know and we'll be happy to see if you would be a good fit. All right, take care and thanks so much for watching.